February's Tokyo treat, the the month of love, the Valentine's Day, the, the leap year, I don't know. Um, it's a box that I got in February 2018. I'm excited to open it. I've um I've moved homes, homes, moved homes now, so I may still continue to film these here because it feels good. Um, I, that's the plan anyway. If anything changes, I'll let you know. But can it be? Is the leaflet back because they were yeah so people were complaining that the book they really liked the booklet or not complaining but they when they did make their opinion known and Tokyo Treat sent out a survey saying what did you think of the booklet blah 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 and then I answered that I did like it because I like to know what I'm eating or rather I like to know it's secret and then just make fun of you whilst you eat it yeah yeah <coughs> this month's um, theme I think is love for your sweetheart I want to have a little look in the booklet Has it, does it look any different like no. how you used to, or is it still pretty similar? I received an email about these, and I swear these, um, I think it was sour plum crisps. Oh boy. Sour plum, I think, is like a, they've gone with lots of spring flavors in the next box, which I'm looking forward to because some of it sounds like amazing. But I'm really intrigued. Let's find out what these are. It's not, it's not umeboshi plum, is it? No, not. Or maybe sour. Koika sour plum. So, because umeboshi plums so, are ridiculously uh, sour, like. Unbearably sour. Quakey sour plum? So I don't think it is. Okay, but it's a sour plum thank, crisp. Thank God for you. <gasps> some of the stuff. Oh, some of the stuff looks so good in this month. They just smell like normal crisps. They don't smell any different. Oh, why did I pick that way? Oh, I'll do. Always expect something more when you have like sour plum flavour, but it is literally just a crisp. There's definitely a tang. Yeah. But it's not umeboshi plum then for sure you'd be rolling it's sort, around. It's sort of like sour, but you wouldn't know what this is really. Like, they've got like almost like a pink tinge in like some a, of them. Like a dusting. Mm. I like them. It's so weird. It's like sweet and sour and savory. spicy at the same time and savory. A kind of vinegar tang that you would get with salt and vinegar crisps. Yeah. Yeah. But there's something else as well. Yeah. It's really interesting. Like a floral... <coughs> yes. I've never tasted it. It's like a floral vinegary. Yeah. But it's nice. Like it's a really sweet. good. Oh, I'm really glad to have tried those. I'm really glad they sent them. Thank you, Tokyo Dream. I think I just want to go for these because they're standing out. I have it in my teeth. This one's next. I don't know what it is. I'm seeing... Is that ra or fu? Is it rasuku? Rasuku? Oh, rask. Yep. I don't really know. It's just strawberry. <coughs> it's an like Ichigo. It's strawberry flavoured rusky sweet thing. Where do I? How do I? No. Ah. I'll be honest, I can't see any pretty awful ones this time. Oh, uh, well, maybe this is going to be another one like or maybe I'm just, August box? Or August? maybe I'm just doubling down and it's a bluff. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. They're really strawberry. Oh. Mm, different. They feel like. I feel like I've had something like this where it's been like a biscuity thing. Like, oh, yogurty. It looks like it's covered in yogurt. It's like a rice cake. Sounds like a rice cake. Mm. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's so nice. That is so, so nice. It's sort of covered in like a yogurt thing. It dissolves pretty quickly. It's, it's got a crunch like a rice um, crispy in that. Like a yogurty covered strawberry snack it's like a the texture's like a rice crispy cake i think that's the best way i can describe it but they're really really good you can't really see so much on this one like if you see you you can maybe see bits of the yogurt i, I find with these things like a, their strawberry flavored snacks smell really strongly of strawberry and cheese smells very strongly of cheese and lemon tastes very very lemony but that was nice I'm getting a mix of plum crisps as well Mm. Which was we're going through one of, of, of at least like one of our five like plum crisps, strawberry rice cake <coughs> things. Oh, 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 oh you're gonna love these. Yeah. Oh, cola. Cola, gorgeous. What's cola. That got, what's that got to do with Valentine's Day? I don't. Oh yeah, I'm not really seeing a. Well, that's for your love. So I guess they're not gonna send you fishy, cheesy things because you don't want Fish. that. <laughs> but like these kind of things, like they, they send you sweets, which is sweet. <laughs> you know the last ones had like one, they had a one and a five up here and I was like, oh, one of your five vegetable crisps. Blah. Maybe it just meant like this one, that there might be five packets. Maybe it was saying like, only have one of the five. 
in one sitting. What? Where's the fun in that? <laughs> oh, wow, the smell of cola. Oh. Oh, the tiny little bubble bottle is taking a tiny little Harry Bill's packet. It's a, it's a wonderful, like, hubba bubba cola smell. Mm -hmm. They are just cola gummies, but they're really... Oh, thank you. I'm enjoying this. You're indulging my sweet tooth. Ha <laughs> ha. so nice. It's just cola bottles. But we are not appreciated cola bottles. I know we've had these before. Have we? Not this flavour. I'm sure we have. Something like them. They're... Uh, it's a strawberry theme again. I think they're going with it. I'm sure we've had something that looks like that caramelly thing. That's going to be one of those tear lids. So like if you're going to sell them in your own shop. Oh my god, I'm destroying the box. Like the cutout line defied me. Ooh, there's like little instructions there. Instructions and something. Oh, you can write on them. Okay, I think you can write on them. They look very strange. <coughs> they smell a little odd. They smell like strawberry coke um, hubba hubbers. Oh, and also. There is a bit of an overwhelming strawberry smell going on right now. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? There's like a thing. Um, It's just a snack mat. Like we can get. It's a gum, like you, you pull it out of a strip. Oh, oh maybe it might, it might be those circular things and you pull them out and like, no, it was a chewing gum. It was like a liquidy thing that turned into chewing gum or something like that. You got it in, in sweet stores. I know the one that was in like a reel. That... Yeah, and you pulled it out. It smells a little bit like that, but it also smells like something I swear like, oh, there was something. Oh, I can't mean. Well. They're a little bit dry. There's a lot of the flaky stuff around and not much mm. of the pink inside. They are nice, but like, the, like I say, they're a little bit dry. They are very light as well. Then they've got like a stickiness on top. They're not overly sweet. No. They're, they're not very sweet at all, actually. Like, minus the... Filling, isn't it? The filling and the sugary bit on top. The actual rest of it is sort of like a, an unsweetened pastry, I guess. I see something that looks very anime-ish, uh, anime but I'm gonna go, I'm gonna save that. <gasps> An umaibo! Did you lie to me? <laughs> <laughs> Did no. you lie? Did you straight out lie? No. On this, I'm seeing prawns and lobsters. You liar. <laughs> You're meant to be my brother. Smells a bit like prawn cocktail. Oh, it's fishy. It's a little bit fishy. I'm guessing you're not going to be trying this no. one. No. It'll be selfish of me to, uh, to take it. You're probably eating a bit. You suck. Let's see if you can guess what it is. I'm so conflicted. There's parts where I'm like, it's not too bad. And then other parts I'm like, oh, what was that? So I'll tell you what it is. I'm guessing lobster. It's, uh... Oh! oh aftertaste! Oh, it is shrimp mayonnaise. <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day. What? Why mayonnaise? <laughs> that is such a strange combination. Oh, the... to, to be fair, I don't eat a lot of seafood, so that might actually be a thing, but it sounds weird. For Valentine's Day? Really? <laughs> shrimp mayonnaise? Like what? The aftertaste is diabolical. I'm just, I feel like a Sydney fish market is in my mouth. I think you would be particularly fond of shrimp, and I didn't know if you was fond of mayonnaise either, so... I don't mind mayonnaise, but like... With shrimp? You lied. Eat it! <laughs> Eat it! I need something good. Ooh! Ooh! I'm gonna save that. Ooh! I'm gonna save that too. Oh, this is like a... This looks like an Amaibo again, but like... Remember when we had a chocolate thing? Ooh! Is it, Matt doesn't recognise it, so maybe this is part of the Dagashi bag? I don't see that one. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's core. Whoa, it's upside down. Okay. <laughs> How to read? Choco, choco, chocolate, choco bar. Oh, it's a choco bar. Choco bar, it's a choco bar. Do you know what I was thinking? The length of it reminded me of. I think it was November's box. We got that long, like nutty, chocolate thing. Oh, it looks like a giant turd. <laughs> well, that's gonna edit it out. <laughs> <laughs> That was way too close to my nose. It looks awful now that you've said that. <laughs> I need to eat it, Sha. I need You're to get rid of the fish. I need to get rid of the fish. Ow. And it's tuna. Oh no. no okay. <laughs> <laughs> Not poo then. <laughs> oh, it's like chocolate. a chocolatey crispy. So yeah, like the crispy things. Dive it on my teeth. Mm. It's like a chocolatey rice crispy snack again, but like that, but you. Every now and then, get chunks of chocolate. <laughs> Smells good like Coke Puffs or something. 
Mm. There is enough mm. sweetness that is pleasant. Mm. <coughs> That's really good. Mm. Yeah, I really like that. that Chocolate bar, Z. What in God's name is this? Oh no. <gasps> Japanese culture in a bag. Oh, 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 it's a mixing thing. It's a cup. Oh God, no, not again. Suiku, itseku. Shake? Maybe shake? Yep. Oh, footy footy shake. Pretty cure, DIY, shake, milkshake. Do it yourself, shake, milkshake. I'm intrigued. That's so fail. Is it actually like a little cup in there then? Oh, there is a little cup in there. It's adorable. Definitely. Then I probably need those instructions. Based on the history of the DIY things on this channel, we probably need the instructions. Is it just safe to say I put it in the thing and shake it? Oh, oh, hold well on. Nice job. Yeah. I think it's saying add ice. No. We don't have ice, so and it's, it's a winter. really tiny cup. It's really like it's actually proper durable plastic cup. I mean, oh my god, you're not kidding. Yeah, it's really like a hard plastic cup. I might keep that. <laughs> keep, might keep, it, that. keep it for our place. <laughs> I think it's saying add milk. That would help with the milk. Can I just say how hilarious the cup looks that it's kind of in scale with you despite it being really small? It looks like a normal size cup. I don't know if it's like the perspective or <laughs> what. It does say milk, right? Uh, we don't have ice cream. I mean, so I don't know some. what it says, Sarah. It's not in English. <laughs> it's in Japanese. Oh, it's really strawberry. Okay, so I think it's gonna be a strawberry milkshake. What's the little golden sticker on there? I got a golden sticker. What is it? Well, there's a code underneath. Huh? There is? There's a code, but I have no idea what I'm meant to do with it. It's just two Japanese symbols, though. Yeah, but it's... Oh, my Google Translate. What? I never think of this. <laughs> I don't know, because you're trying to learn Japanese. Yeah, probably. It does say on here, as an additional Valentine's Day treat, you can even keep and use the included cup afterwards as a regular kawaii cup. See? Powdered soft drink, sugar, vanilla... Oh, that's the... Um, that's okay, all, that's all what's in this. it. Please be careful to the Guardian. <laughs> Since the tip of the store is sharp... I'm going to guess it's milk. Okay. I'm just sure. going to do this. So, a milk seems... powder first. Do you need ice for a milkshake? Yeah, I do, but I, I think we have a milkshake machine, not a plastic cup. Add the milk to the heart level, apparently. There's like a little heart on it somewhere. Oh, oh, there. <clears throat> yeah, that's where you add the milk to. Really? Yeah. What, you add that first? Yeah. I don't think we have enough in here. No, we really don't have enough. Yeah, in go here. get the other one. Right. So, I, I no fill it to the heart. Around. You see the heart there? I'm filling to the heart. Give your heart. I believe that's what it's telling you to do. If not, I've just got a lovely cup of milk. Then you add your little powder stuff and ice if you had it. And I'm meant to shake this. Yeah, it's you very put there's a, there's a full lid. Full cup of milk. <laughs> you put the lid on it. I know. <laughs> oh, it's turning pink at the bottom. Oh. Or it's all just. Co coagulated at the bottom. Hold on, then, where's the straw line? There's like a little. There's a Is little. Is there a hole for the straw? Because yes. I don't want to like the milk to come out there and squirt me in the no, eye. No, you cup it over. You cup your hand over the top of it and then just shake it. This feels odd. I, I feel like this is going to go everywhere in a second. I'm just going to accidentally let go. It's dripping out. <laughs> Something's dripping. I'm shaking this like it's a can of paint. Like spray paint. Obviously. Maybe it is. I mean, it... <laughs> don't take the cap off. You leave it on. Oh, I leave it on, but there's yeah. no. There is the little divot bit that you you can poke it through. Oh, for goodness' sake! <laughs> what happened? Why? Why, why did it foam? There we go. Milkshake. Oh, it's the straw. No, that's also on on a mixed bit of powder. You're really just going to get powder. You're just going to put it through and just be powder. Is it sour or something? Yeah, it's really sweet. <laughs> I just realised the bloody milk is in the <laughs> frame. Well, it's very sweet. Well, I mean, milkshakes are pretty sweet. It's not this sweet. <laughs> the only kind of milkshakes I really would go like, oh, my milkshake is like a galaxy milk chocolate bar. But strawberry, when it's just like the powdered strawberry ones or this, uh, the strawberry in particular, I find it very like, Nye. Oh, it's so sweet. Not my cup of tea, but it's it's, it's um it's a hell of a lot better than the prawn mayonnaise. It's different. It's different. So much strawberry. We have literally, I think, we <coughs> robbed Japan of 
they're strawberry. This is Japan's total Stop. strawberry exports. I wasn't over keen on that. No. I like sweet things, but that was really, really quite sweet. I do like the cup, and maybe I will keep it. If I ever have kids around my, my place. And they're not thirsty. Yeah, they're gonna have a tiny cup, which I'm going to be a good guardian and make sure because the, the end of the cup is pointy and sharp. Next, I'm going to go to the. Oh, I thought it was chocolate bar. Nope. Rose and berry. <laughs> Rose and berry. What is it? Um, Glomatic tablets. I have no idea the what. Glomatic tablets. Not a clue. I would have preferred a chocolate bar. They look oh, like they're uh, in a makeup pot. It says, popular brand of Lost brings you this glomatic tablet treat that helps your breath smell lo uh, smell of lovely wild roses and berries. I must okay. be honest, I've never wanted my breath to smell of either roses or Us berries. Usually mint. Am I doing something wrong? No, they, yeah, 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 yes. <laughs> they, they, they come. Oh, they only come out like that one, one at a time. Yeah. Mmm, berry. What's up? Reminds me of, um, mmm, poison berry. What's that from? <laughs> oh, <I laughs> from it's from, it's, it's, it's from nope. a... That's just you. No, it's not. It's a Disney film. <laughs> You're just strange. La Bugs Life, the caterpillar, when he pretends he's eaten inside, his, like his head's been chopped off, and he pops out and he goes, mmm, poison berry. Slightly floral smell. Mm. No, mm. Mm. it's dissolving. It's like a strange mint. sensation on my tongue. Mm. It's sort of like it isn't. I feel like it's mint, but it's not mint. It's not unpleasant. It's not unpleasant. It's weird. You know, it's like I've said before, the things you used to put on your tongue and they made your mouth smell of mint. It's got that kind of element in that it's doing something powerful to make your breath smell like the thing you're eating, but it's nice. Yeah, it's right. And I smell like. Glomatic rosemary. Yeah, it's almost okay. sour if you bite them. No, they're not bad though. I do that a lot, I find. They're just interesting. They're like like you would have a mint, you would have. Yeah. I'm trying to think of the name of mint. Smints, I think. Smint, yeah, like a smint, but they dissolve but more than not, not Obviously not mint. Pardon me. Last we have a lolly. I absolutely love the last time they sent me a lolly. I'm gonna guess it's strawberry because I'm sensing a strawberry thing. Okay. Has there only actually oh no, there's been two. I was gonna say, has there only actually been one savory thing this time? There's been two. The crisps and the fish. It's not as pink as I was expecting it to be on the uh, like on the pack, it's very pink. So not as white. Yeah. No, but the bottom bit, oh the bottom bit, if I remember that it was like a caramel of goodness. Mmm, caramel, mmm, toffee. It's made to taste like a double scoop of ice cream. One vanilla scoop and the other strawberry. I'm just getting toffee. Oh wait, who actually eats a lolly like that? Again, excuse the saliva. I'm not really getting, all I get is, no, I'm not getting, I'm just getting toffee. <coughs> mm. oh, I like it. Every now and then I get like a taste of strawberry. <laughs> But mainly I'm getting coffee from this. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. <laughs> I actually very much like this box. I, I remember the last... One of my favourite boxes that stood out was the August box, I believe. And I, I said that was my favourite. This was really pretty damn good. Like, the strawberry snacks were nice. The cola. The chocolate. Oh, man. This was... No. <laughs> We're not related. They must have a thing with like strawberry and Valentine's there, uh, right? Maybe, yeah. Uh, well, I suppose like strawberries is a sort of romantic fruit. Chocolate and strawberries and dipping. Why? What? Just shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get Glenn some prawn cocktail crisps for Valentine's Day. Oh. I've heard prawn mayonnaise. Yeah. I've heard. Heard. Of <laughs> I enjoyed this box very, very much. Like, it seriously indulged my sweet tooth. Let me know what you got in your box if you got a box. Or if you haven't and you want to subscribe to Tokyo Drink, the link is in the description below. You should if you enjoy Japanese food or just food from around the world. And they do have a shop, I believe, so you don't have to subscribe to the Tokyo Treat box, but you can just buy little bits and stuff. So they may even have the things that they had in this month's box for sale if you wanted to get anything. Make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. I, I, I obviously do this monthly. Make sure you check out one of the other videos if you haven't already. They should be somewhere there. And once again, guys, thanks very much for watching. Cheers, guys. See you next one.